part of Volta cohort because for a tech startup in Halifax, the best place to be right now here is to be with Volta. So I wanted, so I had it as a vision. I think it was in, in March of 2019. So I used to go to the mezzo floor and just go and look inside. I say, what if Blocks is here? And I can envision Blocks logo and, and the working space. So I had it as a goal. And to do that, I needed to pitch more, to understand more, how can I be accepted? How can I win? So I asked people who won. I got a lot of advice and I kept practicing. I go pitch in every possible pitch competition that I, I can. And I didn't win them all. Actually, in the beginning, we didn't win, but we got better and better. And then almost all the competitions we entered after that, we are like we won. So the progression is um, you start small, you learn, you improve, you ask people. I ask everybody I know, how can I be with uh, at, at Volta? What should I do? How can we improve? And people will criticize you, but you have to take it, learn from it, improve. And, and, and the way we, since we started until now, there is a huge improvement. There is so much progression. Um, you can, some, some of my friends, they said, uh, I can't believe where you were until where you are at in terms of product, in, ter in terms of everything at the block. So, so definitely we started slow, how Volta Academy, all the pitch competitions, and then we went to Volta cohort and we won it. So this is our app. Uh, it's a nice looking app for sure. So basically you go there, you select what you like to do, whether it's sports or fitness. Once you do that, you can um, search by a specific activity. If you just want zoom by, you click here and so forth. Then you can see the fitness instructors who are on the platform. Then you see the partners that we're working with now. For example, Halifax Plays have a lot of groups that uh, organizes uh, sports, you can join them. Um, and also here you can see the, your groups, the people you are following, and you can simply join these groups. You can, um, let's say I just wanna join this activity, which I'm already in. Um, but you see instead of leave, let me go to another activity so you can, let's say I wanna join um, Leanne's activity. She has 13 spots left and she's doing Zumba. Just click here, there's a, a waiver, and then you just join, simply join. I'm in now, I can add it to my calendar. I can invite people as well, and, and then people get notified to just join the activity, and that's it. And I can share it to Instagram story, I can invite people, and then I can chat with other people as well. So anybody who you wanna chat with, you can come here, chat together and just chat together in the app. That is a, just a quick demo of Bloxo. So I'm Christine Wardpage. I'm the founder of eOceans and I'm a marine scientist and I've spent 20 years doing marine research around the world and found that marine research was really slow. And so eOceans is building digital tools to speed up ocean science it's for people powered science. So that's scientists and citizen scientists to be digitizing their data in the field. Right now as scientists, we go out to the field and we take a pencil and a paper and a, and a phone usually as a GPS unit and we write down latitude, longitude on a rocking boat and it's all messy and then we go and take pages and pages of notes and we take them back to a computer and we re-enter them all into a spreadsheet. So we're trying to change, we're changing that right from the beginning. So using an app where you digitize your data and it's faster, more efficient and more accurate right from the very beginning. And then you can collaborate and do everything else in real time so much faster. Somehow I enrolled myself in Volta Academy and that changed everything. So it was, I went from zero where I was an academic and knew very little <laughs> about business and scaling and building software, although I'd had this idea for many years. And I took Volta Academy and met some very helpful people in very different fields that are specialized in helping um, technology, mostly startups, um, and have a lot of experience and they gave back and gave so much information to help me figure out how to navigate this because I went from, yeah, like 
knew nothing about how to do this. And then, um, and then pitching to Volta Cohort, just putting in an application and trying and going up on that big stage was changed everything for me. We wouldn't be here without uh, the mentors that we got as, as well. Like, uh, I guess through both the tone has been a mentor to us since damn near day one. Um, I email him every now and then and he will hop on uh, almost immediately. And I just want to say that Volta has been great to us. Uh, we've been with Volta since April last year and um, working and getting help from Volta has been um one of the, I guess, cogs in the wheel to helping us succeed. We appreciate it. I, we've, we've definitely come a long way. I think our philosophy is to never take the pedal off the gas. And when you have momentum building, um, it's easier to keep it going. And so we've just always tried to never lose that momentum. And so we're always what's next, what's next. And I think that's what you see if you follow our monthly updates or if you follow us as a company, we hear that a lot. People saying, how did you do all of this in 30 days? And I think it's a buildup of just what we're always pushing harder and harder. And so really it is a buildup of the last two years. Uh, we found, we were founded in January, 2018. And then we won the Volta pitch competition and the $25,000 there in November, 2018. Um, and I think that for us was a bit of like the kick in the ass, if you will, to actually do something um, and to do it. So we had one client before and we knew there was potentially something here, but you know, it was a, are we gonna really try to make something of this business? And once we got Volta and then we had a team of mentors and advisors and the 25K and an office, then it was like, okay, this is real. This is a company, this is a startup, let's go. And it almost gave us the validity to do it, or it almost gave us permission to, to act like a startup, I think. And that's kind of how we are. And we, we've, yeah, we've tried to grow across provinces, lately across the states. Um, but I think we've just kept that idea of like, there's a hunger and we're not going to stop till we take over the world kind of idea. And um, we didn't have that prior to Volta and then we definitely had it after Volta.